Hello, my besties, and welcome to another reaction. Today, I got for you a song called Wah Wah. It's by Judge Harrison, and it was requested for by Scott Walker. So let's go get it. I like that very catchy you know i like all the layered instruments you know the guitars and you know all that you know um but i i noticed that the sound it sounded almost as if um as if you know um the track you know has been put through something so it's not you know so it's not very very out there you know because it sounds so distant so far away you know um i think this is how it's meant to be because this version that i'm like um that i'm like reacting to is actually like a remastered version so if anything it should sound more enhanced so this is how it's meant to be and um i think maybe if it had been recorded normally you know i think it probably would have sounded better for me that is you know i don't like the fact that it's so it sounded so far away but apart from that i love it i love the bass line i love the groove you know i love the melody of the song and um i think it's very very catchy um more to come <laughs> I know this might sound very audacious, you know, how dare me have an opinion, you know, on the song of a Beatle. We talk about Judge Harrison here. But um, I think the song is so good, you know, the melody, the groove, you know. I think it would have been even twice as good if it had been, like, kept simple. Simple in the sense that, you know, not too... Um, I think it's too busy to start with, you know. And then I think that effect, for me... I think it does a lot of, of, of a disservice to the song, you know. I can imagine George doing this song like um like um what's that other song called? Um, My sweet lord, you know, with the guitars, you know, the drums, his voice, and just out like that. I don't mean like just those instruments, but I, I just meant like you know that raw vibe that I had, you know, that clarity. This would have been like a a, a 
seriously like, you know, fantastic song. And I just think, you know, um, I, I, I cannot even hear what he says properly, you know, um, because of that effect. I just think it's a shame that they've got that effect in it, you know. I think this song is too good for all that. This song should have been left, you know, on its own to just like ride, you know. I really feel so. Um, I'm sorry if I'm offending anybody here, but that's just the way I feel, you know. Um, I love the melody. I love the song, you know. I love the, the, the bass line, you know, the guitars. But I just think there's too much effect on the song, you know. Uh, all that far away sounding, you know, like it's from a distance. I, I don't... I don't like it, you know, but um, I'm going to see if there's another version of this song, maybe did an acoustic version, you know, um, this could easily have been my second favorite Judge Harrison song, that's how much I love the melody of the song, but um, that effect just does something to me, man, um, I'm sorry guys, <laughs> let's get some more, sorry Scott. <laughs> need to know who's playing bass on the song you know <laughs> then you know um i think i hear two distinct guitars so i will not be surprised if it's not only george on this song as a guitarist you know um yeah you know the guitars are fantastic on the song man <laughs> you know you know the two different guitars i hear they're fantastic you know so the guitars and the bass amazing stuff and like i keep on saying the melody is just like ridiculously good you know but um it's just too busy for me man too busy man it's um <laughs> That's interesting. I was saying that, you know, I didn't quite, you know, you know, hear what he was like saying in the vocals. But um he was saying, I don't need your wow wow. And I'm thinking that means um I don't need your trouble or your baggage and all that, you know. I think that's what he's saying there. And then at the end I hear a car drive away. So I'm thinking he's saying, you know, I'm getting away from all your troubles, you know. I don't need all this hassle. I think that's what it is that happened there. Um, another clever thing that I think he did with this song is, you know, the wah-wah, for those of you who might not know, is a guitar, you know, it's a guitar effect, you know, that you put on a guitar, you know, that wow 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 you know, that sound, you know, and it's a distortion, 
you know? So, um, and as you know, distortion doesn't give you clarity, you know? Um, so I think he he used the term wah-wah because he's saying, you're giving me a wah-wah, which means you're like a, you're, you know, you're like a, a disruption, a distortion, you know? Um, you're, you're like, um, really, you're like making life not so um, not so good for me. I think that's what it's did there. And I think that's very, very clever. You know, you're giving me a wah-wah, you're giving me like a, you know, a headache, your pain, you know, um, I don't see no clarity and all that, you know, I think that's what it's done there. Clever. <laughs> Maybe I should check out the lyrics actually and, and, and see if I can get a better perspective of this. And also I'm going to check out who played the bass and, uh, and guitar on the song, because like I said to you, I love the guitars and I love the bass player. So let's just take a second to check that out. Okay. It's, it's that guy. Klaus Brumann, I know that guy. He played um he played on um a few um um uh, John Lennon songs. Um, I like him, you know. And he's a good he's a good bassist. So he played bass on this, right? Okay, okay. The guitarist, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, mamas and papas, was Eric Clapton. <laughs> no wonder. And I missed that. Bill Preston was on it as well. Okay. It, it was hard to hear lots of things there because, um, you know, there was so much going on, you know. I, I think, um, I don't know, I, I've been saying that too much, you know, but I, I love the song so much and it's just a shame that, you know, um, I couldn't hear it properly. Um, I don't know. It'll be interesting to see what you guys think, uh, you know, about, um, about what I said, you know. Uh, I'd like to hear your take on it and I'm really looking forward to that. Anyway, I thank you for like stopping by. If it was your first time here, uh, thank you for like um, stopping by. I hope you had a great time. Hope you come back again. Better still, I hope you subscribe and become a you know a member of the family. I'm looking forward to that. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big like for me, so that the guys at YouTube can you know share it to many more people. And thank you for this as well. My name is Harry. Stay cool. Stay safe out there wherever you are. But most of all, stay beautiful in your heart and soul because we don't need no hours. <laughs> bye bye. Yeah. <laughs>